According to a tweet from well-known leaker Anthony, Qualcomm is apparently producing two variants of its Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 chip. This chip will be used in the upcoming Galaxy S24 Ultra smartphone everywhere it is sold, as well as the Galaxy S24 and S24 Plus models in the US and China. For the time being, we're only focusing on how the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 chip will be used in the Galaxy S24 Ultra. Anthony explains that there are two types of Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 chips for the Galaxy phones, one of which is faster and uses a core part of the Galaxy Cortex X4 Prime Core at 3.4 GHz, while the, the Galaxy S24 Ultra phones released in the United States and Korea will use a slightly slower 3.3 GHz version of the chip. Samsung is attempting to get the attention of people who have not yet heard about their new Galaxy S24 phone and may like to purchase it. The most recent leak also includes two real-life photos allegedly showing the Galaxy S24 Ultra, which appears to have a gold color option. To be honest, the Galaxy S24 Ultra has been shown in many pictures and renders before, and this isn't the first time it's been seen in real photos, but the recent images highlight the phone in a gold color, including a matching gold frame. These leaks have also verified the flat screen and the design. The new Galaxy S24 has a flat screen rather than a curved screen, which strengthens it and removes the need for pricey screen protectors. The back is similar, with a matte surface and a lighter titanium frame. The general look hasn't altered much, and many people, including me, are pleased with the design. The regular Galaxy S24 will have a 6.2-inch 120Hz dynamic AMOLED display with a resolution of 2340 by 1080 It will employ Samsung's most recent M13 OED panels, which will be protected by Gorilla Glass Victus 2 and strengthened with aluminum 2.0 for extra durability, as well as a front camera with a 12-megapixel punch hole for selfies and a back camera. The phone has a 50-megapixel main camera, a 12-megapixel ultrawide lens, and a 10-megapixel telephoto lens. It will be powered by the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 in the United States and South Korea, while the Exynos 2400 will be used in Europe. Using USS 4.1 technology, the gadget has 8GB of RAM and storage capacities of 128GB or 256GB. Finally, what are your thoughts about it? So without been said let me know your thought in the comment below and if you are new here please subscribe peace out.